Let's consider next problem statement to design the DFA. Language L is W such that second symbol from right in W is A. And we are going to consider two different alphabets. This alphabet contains A and B. This alphabet contains A, B and C. Here we have to apply a little bit of trick. Now consider a simple string B, A, A, B, A, B. So this is left side of the string. This is right side of the string. Now someone may think that start processing the string, go to the end, come back and check if second symbol from right is A. But DFA does not have this capability. DFA cannot go back and forth on the string. DFA can process the string only from left to right. It cannot come back. Now first let's see which strings are part of the language and which strings are not part of the language. Condition is second symbol from right should be A. Any string whose length is less than 2 will not be part of the language. Epsilon A B length is less than 2. We cannot have second symbol from right as A. They are not, not part of the language. If we consider strings like B A A A B A B then here second symbol from right is A. They are part of the language. Any string where second symbol from right is not A, they are not, not part of the language. So let's design the DFA. Now DFA cannot go back and forth on the string. But what DFA can do is it can hold finite information. Here the condition is second symbol from right should be A. What DFA can do is it can keep track of last two symbols. And if second symbol from right is A, when the string ends, then we accept the string. Otherwise, we reject the string. So what do you mean by keeping track of last two symbols? Consider this example. DFA starts processing this string from left to right. When DFA processing reaches over here, DFA will know that last two symbols are AB. So this is what we are going to do. How we are going to do, we will understand when we actually design the DFA. Then when DFA processing reaches over here, it will know that last two symbols are BA. And while doing this, it will reach to end of the string. So here it will know last two symbols are AB. It is keeping track of last two symbols. So when DFA processing reaches to end of the string, here it knows last two symbols are AB. Here it checks what is second symbol from right. It is A. So it will accept the string. And one more thing. When DFA processing is over here. It knows last two symbols are AB. And now this B comes. So last two symbols will change from AB to BB. When DFA processing over here. Last two symbols are BA. Now A comes. So last two symbols will change from BA to a. So this is what we are going to do. Now to keep track of two symbols, we have two options for each place. We have to keep track of last two symbols. Here it can be A or B. Here it can be A or B. So we have four options A, 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 B, B, A, B, B. So we keep track of these, these possibilities. Now condition is second symbol from right is A. As long as only B's are coming. We cannot have second symbol from right as A. It has to wait for A. We name this state as BB. Because we have to keep, keep track of these four possibilities. As long as B's are coming we remain in state BB. We have to keep waiting for A. Now if A appears, this state remembers last two symbols as BB. After that A comes. So here last two symbols are BB. Now they change from BB to BA. So this state is BA. Now another A comes. 
तो वी आर इन स्टेट बी ए लास्ट टू सिंबॉल्स आर बी ए नाउ ए कम्स सो लास्ट टू सिंबॉल्स विल बी ए ए सो धिस स्टेट इज ए ए नो एट ए ए वी आर इन स्टेट ए ए अनदर ए कम्स लास्ट टू सिंबॉल्स विल चेंज फ्रॉम ए ए टू ए ए इट सेल्फ so we remain in state a a now we let's handle b at state b a while in b a if b comes last two symbols will change from b a to a b so we add new state a b so here we have to handle b while in a a if b comes state changes from a a to a b last two symbol change from a a to a b this is b while in a b if a comes last two change last two symbols change from a b to b a a b to b a on a while in ab if b comes last two symbols change from ab to bb what about final states so here last two symbols are bb second symbol from right is b non final state second symbol from right is b non final state if string processing is in aa that means second symbol from right is a so if string processing ends in this state we have to accept the string so we mark this as final state here also if string processing ends in this state it means second symbol from right is a so we mark this as final state and accept the string now let's take one simple example we will see how string is processed in this dfa consider string b b a a b this is one string string processing will start at b b these are states on this b it will remain in b b on this b it will remain in b b now b comes so it will remains in b b if a comes it will go from b b to b a so look at this while string is in b a while string processing is in b a last two symbols are b a b a now a comes we go from b a to a a and if b comes we go from a a to a b so here this means last two symbols are ab it means second symbol from right is a so we accept the string that's why these two are final states now let's take look at number of states and number of final states so here alphabet con the condition is second symbol from right should be a so we have, we can we have to keep track of two states at each state we have two options so we have total two power two options or we have to consider two power two possibilities this two is related to second symbol from right if we have to consider third symbol from right we need to consider two power three states what about this two now you may think that here we have to consider two possibilities a and b because there are two alphabets in the give there are two symbols in given alphabet but that is not the case this two is for two possibilities a and other than a here for other than a we have only one option b this two is for two possibilities a and other than a this two is not for number of symbols so when we design dfa for alphabet contains a b and c we will not require 3 power 2 states 
we we still require two power two states so let's so let's we will look at that but let's see how, how many number of final sets are there so four possibilities are a a a b b a b b out of these four for half of them second symbol from right is a in these two states second symbol from right is not a for these two states so total number of states are 2 power 2 and number of final states is 2 power 2 divided by 2 is 2 power 1 now let's consider this alphabet which contains three symbols now the dfa will remain exactly like this the only thing is we have to handle this new symbol c so the basic dfa we will draw just like that we will name states later now here we are naming states like b b b a a a b so here what to do here we will if it is a we have to name it as a if it is other than a we will call it as x x means b or c anything other than a so this state will be xx here it is ba it will become xa this will be aa this will be ax transitions of a will remain exactly same here we have a here we have a here we have loop for a and then here we have a wherever there is b we have to handle b or c so here we have to handle b or c b or c b or c b or c so these two dfas they are exactly same the only difference is here for other than a we have only one option b here for other than a we have two options b and c so this state state xx it handles last two symbols bb or bc or cb or cc xa it handles ba and ca ax handles ab and ac Now we will process one small string B, C, B, A, C. Processing starts in XX. When we process B, we remain in XX. While in XX, we process C, we remain in XX. So here, last two symbols are BC other than a other than a xx then while in xx we handle b we remain in xx so this state handles bb or bc or cb or cc right now it is handling cb now while in xx if a comes we go to xa we go to xa because last two symbols are ba b is for x other than a and after that c comes so we go to state so while in xa when we handle c we come to ax so we come to ax so ax handle ab or ac so we here last two symbols are ac that's why we are in ax in ax second symbol from right is a this is final state and the string is accepted so here number of states is still 2 power 2 so total possibilities are 4 plus 2 6 plus 2 8 and 9 so using 2 power 2 states we are actually handling 
थ्री पावर टू दैट इज नाइन पॉसिबिलिटीज नंबर ऑफ स्टेट्स इज टू पावर टू एंड द सिंपल रीजन इज वी आर ओनली इंटरेस्टेड इन वेदर द सिंबॉल इज ए और इट इज नॉट ए अदर दैन ए फॉर अदर दैन ए वी हैव टू ऑप्शन सो वी हैव सो दे आर ग्रुप टूगेदर If alphabet is A, B, and C, and the condition is third symbol from right in W is A, we will require two power three states. Here also we have half of the states as final states and half of the states as non-final states. 